lot of times we see guys with speed and power, right? But it's rare that you see guys with speed and power fighting at 140 and you coming in at 138, 137. Like, like, to talk to me about that. Like, is that something that y'all do on purpose? Because a lot of times you just see guys come in like a half a pound, but it seemed like you always two, three pounds under. You know what I mean? Uh, that's just me being ready, so I won't have to get ready. You know, they say a yeah. man fails the plan, plans to fail. Facts, facts. Now, now with that plan, right? We know historically in the sport of boxing, one thirty-five is a glamour division. Now, if you could get the one thirty-seven, one thirty-six. Is it is it that much more harder to get the one thirty five? Could you ever see yourself fighting it? Uh, I could if it was some type of contract deal or, or, or mm -hmm. catch a weight stuff yeah. and some some personal vendettas. Okay, <laughs> something happen. We can shake up the boxing world now. It's already happening, you know. Well, well, we well since you already took it there, you know, you you know, I'm gonna go next. Um. What I really want to know is, champ, you you from Maryland, D.C. area. Tank is from Baltimore area, not too far. Right. Where did the Russell Davis beef start at? It really wasn't no beef. It's just the, the tenacity of a, of a fighter. Okay. We're fighters. Okay. You know, he representing his area. We representing our areas. Yeah. He feeling as though he, he's a stomper and he want to make, yeah. make a lot of noise and kick up a lot of dust. Mm -hmm. So be it. We don't take we don't take no uh, offense to it. Yeah. He's going in the ring. He, mm -hmm. This is like some this is boxing talk. For sure, for sure. You know, this is athlete yeah. trying to be a better athlete on the East Coast. The athlete, but trying to be a better athlete on the West Coast. That's that's mm -hmm. some some stuff that that's going to turn into. It. And a lot of people they just covering up with the niceties of complexities when it comes to the to the wordplay. They call it beef, but it ain't no beef. It's just an athlete being an athlete. Mm -hmm. And if y'all. If y'all really want to get things situated, we can line it up. We can make it happen. But don't be saying it's beef because beef can turn into some street stuff. For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. We never yeah, been now, the type to, to beef with nobody. Yeah. It set the record straight, make some corrections, but beef, it's never been a beef. Yeah. So, so even, now. Even, let me hold, let me stop you for real quick. Even at night. Yeah. Instructing him. How to become victorious? He's like, man, mm -hmm. look, the, the shot he got the guy out was the shot that he needed to throw that we was telling him to throw. Yeah, yeah. So how all that happened then? Like, how how all that? How you get in? We uh, so I'm in, I'm in a fight too. Uh, I was like real close to y'all. I just look over. I see Meek standing up. I think I seen uh, Gary Antonio stand up. And I I mean, like, how, how we even get there from 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 that? Ah, uh, you gonna bring that up, man? Look, I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. Simply said, big misunderstanding. Sure. A person that don't box. Yeah. And a person that's just giving instructions to another boxer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's that's easy. That's basically yeah. what it was. You know, we giving instructions to a to an athlete, and you got a person that's not an athlete <laughs> looking outside in, just like man, confused on what's what's being said. Okay. He don't understand the translations. Got you. Got you. You know, okay. so he got in his little feelings or whatnot. Good thing that things didn't uh get magnified, you know, and, and materialize into anything else. Everybody went home safely, gladly. You know what I mean? I'm happy for that. But yeah, but hey, what on the break? 